All right, man, the last battle of this wave is going to be intense. So we've got Bear Scratch 560F TT Bay, but facing off against the Star Wars Bays. So the Mandalorian 360F, Moff Gideon 380 Needle, Luke Skywalker 480B, and Darth Vader 460P. This is probably going to be really fast paced with the Mandalorian. With a big time hit right there. Ooh, those blows. Been thrown off balance. And. Damn. Alright, it goes to Bear Scratch by a little bit. Oh, no. And yo, Bear Scratch getting deflected by the Mandalorian. 2 1. Got it. This is intense, man. And all right, goes the bear scratch. Two. And that's an extreme finish right there. The Mandalorian showing off that attack power. Well, now it's my video. Finish right there. Wasn't quite able to get it. And it goes down. Alright. Well, alright. And oh man, that hit right there. Alright. Yeah. There's Scratch. He's not playing. And gets that bird. This is gonna be a wild one for it. Luke Skywalker. It hit it against the ridge and made it burst out the ridge. So I guess I gotta get that to it. Luke's a head to zero. Oh man, I hit it. Showing off that defense. Perry in the way they attack. And damn, all right, he takes it. So it's three. Luke <laughs> taking all those hits. Oh, and it made a burst, dude, the impact. All right, now it's Darth Vader's turn. Oh, that KO, Bear Scratch, not playing, man. Showing his rhino horn. <laughs> and it took it with that, man. It takes it. So, yeah. But with that being said, that's the last battle for the Star Wars base. Like, this round of battles that I've been doing with them. I'm just going to say, like, it's really, really cool if they made these echoes. I hope that they switch up. Like, if they do any more like crossovers or echoes or anything, they use different molds that we haven't seen a bunch of times. Like, you know, Scythe and Sendio, Leon, Claw, like all the ones they've used for this wave, definitely that being it. At least for the echoes, use different molds going forward. But it's really cool that we had a crossover with Star Wars, like with Marvel, with Transformers. It's really, really freaking dope. And I can't wait to see what other exclusives uh, Hasbro makes going forward with Beyblade X because this is freaking awesome, dude. So, so cool.